All right, this video is going to be a tutorial on a free download that you can get from the internet. Um, you can get it for Mac OS or for Windows and a couple other things. I think there are. It's called Cube Twister. It's a 3D virtual Rubik's Cube software where, like, there are just normal Rubik's Cube and stuff. You can change, like, the background color and stuff. Like, you can do pretty much anything on here. Like, it's awesome. Yeah, the Rubik's Cube signed on here, actually. Let's see. Um, I have the animation. I have the twisteration up all the way. Let's see. There. And if you put it on, like, twisteration on zero, it just kind of clicks. Or, you know, like, it's automatically there. Kind of like a touch cube, I guess. Um, so, yep, there's uh, that. They have the pocket cube. Here, wait one more second. Let's. Oh, there's also this really cool feature. You can make it where it's explode right there. If you drag it up, it'll separate the cube and, like, make its pieces, um, re like, float around its axis, you know? And stuff, it's really awesome. Yep. Um, alright, let's have some more, see some more cubes. Uh, Rubik's Revenge. The Professor Cube, uh, V Cube 6, V Cube 7, which right now is, I took some pieces off it and made smiley faces and stuff. <laughs> uh, v Cube 7, white. Uh, I don't know what's so different about this one. Oh, different color scheme, I guess. It's kind of like inverted, I guess, because a normal Rubik's Cube, it's red, white, and blue. But this here, it's red, blue, and white. And... Uh, yeah. So the cube is kind of, I don't know, just different color scheme. Uh, we have barrel cube or a Arxon barrel, I call it. Um, this one looks really cool and it's exploded because, like, it's like that and stuff. That's all. And we have. Oh, this one's really cool, actually. It's a um, an Arxon diamond. That's what they call it on here. It looks really weird when it's solved. You can't really tell when it's solved. It looks you it just it doesn't really look solved when it's solved. Like from the top, at least it does. When you're like this, though. It's kind of messed up. Yeah. Um. Um. Arxon cube octahedron. Another 3x3 mod, um, you can make this mod, it's just pretty simple, you just kind of like shave down the corners and some of the edges, like you can see this part right here is the edge piece, and this right here, this, um, this hexagon is, and, uh, well, this hexagon and this triangle right here is the corner piece, and that triangle is part of the edge piece, as you can see, so... Um, another thing, just no more, a layered cube, which is really cool, it has just three layers, let's go through this just faster, uh, red, white, red, white, so pretty much half red, half white, uh, different color scheme, which is kind of weird, it's like purple, purple, white, white, red, red, American cube, it's so white, Stickered instead of, or core, excuse me. And then, my color. All these really complicated stickered ones that are really weird. Super cute. All these different things. Oh. That thing. Oh, and you can also click down here on stickers. And you can take off stickers. And there's some way to change the core color, but I haven't figured that out yet. It's like really complicating. And so yeah, here's how you get it. You simply go to like Safari, Internet Explorer, Firefox, whatever you have for internet access. You go up to Google and you type in 
um, you type in cube twister download and then so cube twister download oopsie I spelled it wrong huh? then you click on this one cube twister you click on whichever kind of computer we have or you have whatever like Microsoft uh, whatever you know Mac OS you simply click on it and then open it up and save it to your account and you're good to go so yep um, thanks for watching please comment rate and subscribe